Bloomberg Educated Investor is brought to you by DBFX from Deutsche Bank. There are hundreds of indicators FX traders use to speculate on a country's price direction. One tool compares the cost of goods and services of one country with another. Purchasing power parity is, is a very simple concept, and it basically means the, what is the value of, of the similar commodity good in different currency prices. The Starbucks latte index, where you look at lattes, but the same idea is there, and that is, does my dollar buy the same latte as a Chinese yuan in China? Purchasing power parity, also referred to as PPP, is based on the law of one price. When we had a cup of cappuccino in UK be worth $5 versus $2.5 in New York, that really meant that the pound was extremely, extremely overbought when it was trading around 2 11 to the dollar. Strategists like to use PPP to identify extremes in currency prices. When currencies are very undervalued or very overvalued, say 20 or 30 percent, then they tend to move back towards fair value very quickly, perhaps within a year even. Take the Big Mac index. We like to use PPP for is we try to identify extremes in valuations and then we know that within the next year the currencies are very likely to move back towards fair value. So if you're looking at PPP as a, as a sign of directionality, you should really have a very long-term outlook, perhaps as long as a year and maybe even more so, before you allow yourself the kind of adjustments that, that occur. But beware, PPP doesn't tell the whole story of a country's currency. You should also be looking at the inflation rate of that country. Interest rate differential is very key when you're forming an investment thesis buying a currency. Traders can compare the price of goods and services in various countries by going to the Organization of Economic Cooperation and Development's website at OECD.org. Thanks for watching Bloomberg, The Educated Investor. I'm Carol Biaggi. Bloomberg Educated Investor is brought to you by DBFX from Deutsche Bank.